Hi guys, I'm here doing another quick review. Um, you can see that I'm in my work clothes, so please forgive my monkey suit that I like working in. Um, th this review will be off of these little um, cigarillos, and it's off of this one, the uh, Al Capone Sweets, the Cognac Dip, if I pronounced that right. And this here is a little like cheap pack so you can get this for like under two dollars if you wanted to try it um they didn't have this kind the uh, unfiltered one in the bulk pack so i just figured i just take the two small pack for now and um as far as like cigarette or cigar smoking um i have used full size you know the one the nice big ones that you, you can sit and smoke for like 30 minutes or even more um these are supposed to be like real mini versions of them so um it's pretty interesting. Uh, I always heard some good things about the Al Capone series, so I'm pretty excited to try this out. So uh, let's get down to it. Now this, um, it's a little paper box, and it's, it was easy to open up. Um, looks like uh, there's really no side to open this up, but uh, here we go. And there's two in here. I definitely smell like a really good... Um, I guess like a the sweet flavor of it and it looks like it's for sure a tobacco leaf rolled in you can kind of see like the leaf sorry I'm not very good with my camera but you can kind of see like the uh, rolled up part um, I guess the smaller side is probably the one where you put my mouth on it does taste sweet I definitely taste the dip flavor of that so that definitely it definitely tastes sweet and um, I actually brought my lighter for once so uh, the other time when I was doing this I only had the uh, the car one so this is my actual like firebird quad torch um, butane uh, lighter so or triple torch never mind so this is pretty cool so let's get down to it Actually tastes pretty good. I'm digging this. De definitely tastes flavorful. I'm gonna roll my windows down so that way I don't fog up my car. <laughs> yeah, it tastes tastes really good. Nice, nice body, uh, very bold, really good boldness. I like it. I even stopped by QT and got myself a frozen uh, um, coffee. It's like a caramel or something. I like it. It's got a, it's got a really good flavor to it. Really strong. This is definitely something I would smoke if I was uh, chilling, which I am right now before work. It's not too strong. You definitely get a really strong boldness taste. I mean, it's not overpowering what I meant by it being too strong. It's definitely got a nice boldness to it. This is the unfiltered one, so this is not the uh, it's not the uh, filtered kind. So I can give the filter ones a try, maybe see if there's like a difference in them. But it tastes fine to me. It's burning pretty decently slow, so it's not doing it too fast like a standard cigarette or, you know, like anything else. Yeah, it's, it's not going too fast. It's burning pretty decent. So I probably would, uh... I would smoke it until there's like that much left before it gets too close to my finger fingertips. But I lit the side that was had the the wider end, and that's not trying to not trying to make a inappropriate joke, but I, I lit I lit the side that was bigger than the other one. I guess they have like an area that you put your mouth on or something. <laughs> there we go. 
So you can see so much is burning right now. So you get a lot of bolt, like a lot of body with this little cigar. I can definitely taste the flavor in my mouth. I usually like to pair up my cigars or cigarillos with uh, coffee and sweet and uh, sweet teas. Uh, so I did a review about the Jarm uh, Specials, which is my other favorite. Tastes really good, especially if you like clove stuff or sweet flavored uh, smokes. Highly recommend Jarm brand. It's spelled D Jarm, if y'all guys ever heard of it. But uh, yeah, I definitely approve of these. I definitely went smoke these all the time, but occasionally as a treat. You know, whenever I need a cigar, you know, fix on the road or something, or maybe in a mirror at work. I wonder if people might think I'm smoking a joint when they drive by me and see me with <laughs> this tiny rolled up cigar. Somebody looks like they're about to drive by me and I have my fingers out the window with my mini cigar in my hand. But I'm going to let you guys go because, uh, you know, because I think my time's going to run out here in a, little, in a little bit. But it's how much I have left right there. Fingertips are at the very end. So you can see, so I'll probably smoke it until maybe about here. So I got, you know, a decent amount of time left, like about half of the, the ciggy left. So yeah, I definitely approve of it. So I'm, I'm definitely going to try the uh, Jamaican one next. And so here was the uh, Cognac Sweets dipped. Definitely tasted sweet when I took a dry hit and when I put my mouth on it. So yeah, definitely approve. It's a good smoke. If you guys have any questions uh, or if you have any recommendations, for sure. I'm just a like a socially smoking person. I usually prefer cigars or cigarillos only. I don't really do cigarettes. I don't really like the like the uh, huge tobacco hits on those. I mainly smoke cloves or cigars and stuff. So if you have recommendations of anything, um, let me know. Um, I'm going to do a bulk order of some smokes online to save some money because the smoke shops here is not bad. I go to a place um, off of Broadway called Phoenix Cigars here in my area it's in San Antonio if y'all don't know. But um, if you have any comments, questions, suggestions, just leave me a comment below. And y'all always have a nice day.